Mikhail Kalashnikov had set the bar so high in 1947 that it's difficult if not impossible for modern small arms designers to achieve an evolutionary leap over the AK-47 assault rifle. If Russia has allowed India to license produce submarines and Su Kwa, then there should be no obstacle in the way of license producing a rifle. The Indian Army has decided to end its experiment with the glitch pro and Indian small arms system. INSAS 5 56mm rifle and go for a brand new 7 62mm caliber weapon. As part of its massive modernization drive that will re-equip entire divisions with high-end weapons and over a million troops with advanced personal arms. The army says unlike previous failed attempts, this time it's aiming in the right direction. The Indian small arms project has suffered too many misfires because the generals wanted the equivalent of the Star Wars blaster. Had the army kept its general staff qualitative requirements GSQRs at a realistic level, Indian soldiers wouldn't be saddled with a malfunctioning rifle. According to L.T. Gen Saeed Atta Hasnain, the Indian Army's dream personal weapon of twin caliber capability with changeable barrels to cater for different calibers has resulted in the acute delay in the final decision. There appears to be no takers for this variety which the general staff had desired. Clearly, reinventing the rifle is a futile exercise. Mikhail Kalashnikov had set the bar so high in 1947 that it's difficult if not impossible for modern small arms designers to achieve an evolutionary leap over the AK-47 assault rifle. The larger 7. 62mm caliber that the Indian Army is now seeking is incidentally the same as the AK. Buttressing the Russian weapon's reputation as the most reliable and copied weapon in modern history.